Hey guys, Gavin here from Ezoic. Today we are going to do a live name server transition from a site uh, that's currently on its own name servers over to Ezoic name servers. This is one of the most common things that publishers get hung up on when transitioning to Ezoic. It's how do they integrate with Ezoic. So today we are going to connect to Ezoic C CDN where we are going to use the name server integration and it's going to be done through the registrar name cheat. Um, I'm going to do it today on the site australianpopulation.com. As you can see here, um, this is before the transfer. So what I'm going to do is open my name cheap account over here. Uh, so what we'll do now, go and click to manage the domain for the site that you want to update your DNS for, in this case, Australian population. The current name servers are with SiteGround. So what we want to do is add custom DNS. So I'm going to replace these name servers with SiteGround with new Ezoic name servers. To get those, I'm going to pop into my Ezoic account. Um, you'll see the integrate your site button here. From here, I will click integrate your site. We have two options, name servers or WordPress plugin. The site is built on WordPress, so we could do that option, but name servers are recommended for best results, uh, for best performance. Again, get access to Ezoic CDN. So I'll click view instructions. Here I will get, you'll see that Ezoic imported the existing name servers I showed you previously with SiteGround and also the new custom Ezoic name servers. So I'm going to replace the SiteGround name servers at my registrar. So I'll copy this here, go back to Namecheap here, paste in the new record, bloodhound.ezoicns.com. Go back at the second one, kingfisher.ezoicns.com. Copy and paste in here. We're all set at this stage. Hit save. And then boom, there you go. As you see at the top, DNS server update may take up to 48 hours to take effect. It's normally a lot quicker than that, but that's just a, a rule of thumb that they share with you there. So now my name servers with Ezoic are updated. We'll go back to the site and check it out, refresh the page. As you can see, it's still up and running normally. There are no issues at all. Some publishers think that's a a common thing that happens. I didn't change anything at my host. Super easy. Um, that's the first step of setting up Ezoic, getting your site integrated. Always recommend doing it with the CDN, which in this case was, was through a name server switch. Thanks, hope you found that useful. Feel free to leave any comments below or reach out to me directly at my email address in the below field as well. Take care.